Hi everyone. Today, Friday, July 29th, is Windows 10's first year release anniversary. This is also the last day that Microsoft will be offering this operating system free. To those of you who are not sure whether to upgrade or not, you only have a few hours left to make up your mind. On February 2nd this year, I posted a video on how to resolve HP Printer Driver Update Error 0x802-40017 on Windows 10. This is a follow-up video for that resolution. In that video, we hid the printer from Windows to prevent it from updating the driver since there's no new driver update available from HP. In this video, I'll be showing you how to check if there is a new driver update by going to hp.com support. Under search all support, type in your product number. You can either type in your printer number series, for example, CP1020 series or the exact printer model number. In my case, it is CP1025NW color. Click on search and it will take you to the solutions and update finder. Click on software and drivers. Under option one, check for updates and recommendations suggested. Click check now. It's been almost a year since HP released this update. Although HP has no suggestions for driver updates, I like checking the other softwares HP has on my printer by clicking the plus sign to show what's in them. Aside from checking for driver updates, it is important to check for firmware updates. The firmware updates usually patch lots of security holes and other bugs. They are occasionally needed to make sure your printer operates the way it should, as bugs are fixed and programs are altered for consumers' benefits. Wi-Fi printers and printer data may be vulnerable to hackers, so it's important to update the firmware to prevent this from happening. Under Firmware, click Download. Once you click download, an HP software and driver downloads window will open. Click next. Just click next. The download and install assistant will open showing you the progress of the download. Once the download is complete, click install to begin the installation process. Once it is done, it is best to print a test page to make sure your printer is working fine. Once this is done, I'll show you how to print a test page just in case you need some help on that.
Now we're ready to print the test page. To do this, go to Windows Systems. Control Panel. View Devices and Printers. Then right click your printer. Go down and left click the printer properties. And lastly, print a test page. Once done, click OK. I didn't have any issues after the firmware installation, so I don't think you'll have a problem either. If you need help with a printer, you can find the user guide in your computer under HP. It has everything you need from everyday printing job, maintenance, and solving some printing issues. I hope this video helps you with your updates. If you like this video, please click on the like button at the bottom right corner of your YouTube screen. And don't forget to subscribe for more of my Windows 10 and related topics in the future. Hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time.